in the library what we need is books so first of all you have to add a books so what books here I have already around uh, five books one two three four five I have five six seven eight eight books so now I want to add some more books so I have to click on add new and uh, you have to enter uh, the book um, ID let's say uh, 751 and the group ID you can select anything uh, here the group I already give so later on you'll see now SQL I want to enter book name uh, PL SQL let's say publisher publisher anything you can give PHP or uh, P um, Vikas Publish Because publishing authors, uh, you have to authors the enter the author's name and publishing year in which year the book was published, or else you can just type it and enter, or else you can just choose from here. And edition, it is second edition or whatever edition, and price. What is the price out there? 985 rupees. Status you can just select uh, if it is a new book so you can just select available or uh, at that moment if you are giving for rented then you can give for the rented so let's save it that book is coming PLSQL now um, if you want to delete some books so you select any book or else you can just enter the book ID like this here in the field and then the book will be selected so if you want to delete just click on delete I really want to delete if you really want to delete click on yes or else no let's delete it did a success now uh, we'll go for uh, add group so if we want to add a group, group number 3 is python, group number 4 is blah 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 let's say we want to add something it's already in used so uh, g063 I want to add something like uh, jaw so we want to add that so click on add add successfully jaws we can see out there that is how to add the group now you want to um, add a book so that time you can see if you want to add a book and group ID uh, 0 Z063 that was the joke so it was display it was uh, it was entered that time then it is displayed out here and uh, you can if the customer is coming so if you want to register the customer you can register from here and uh, book issue if you want to issue the book so go from the file menu and click on issue book and which book you want to issue those book the details will be displayed and to whom you want to issue here the customer are there so you can just issue to them now uh, the issuing debt and what is the due debt let's say uh, next 26 March so I click on issue book has been issued now it is issuing so another book you want to issue to someone else or issue new now select anyone and uh, enter the customer name I mean customer ID and then customer name everything will be displayed and then here you can change the date and all click on the issue so that is how to issue now uh, return book after the customer has uh, taken those book only the uh, book issue issued were displayed out here now that in this day there is a uh, person want to return his book whatever he take from the library so now I just click on return so return successfully I just refresh if you want to delete you can just click on the delete but it is always better not to delete and uh, book report this is about the book report uh, you want to search a book ID or uh, according to the status all rented only one book is rented you want to see for all available books every whatever available is the book is available then those things are displayed out here 
and if you want to search for with the book name or book id b002 want to search that so that is book id2 it's java all the details is being given according to book name or uh, those things are your wished and um, that is a book report and exit is to close the application now if you want to add a customer you can go for the customer menu and then go for the add delete update customer and then here the customer can be added all these are the existing customer now you want to add a new customer so just click on add new and this is the customer id now let's say customer name is uh, this one and he stay in let's say and contact number anything and uh, what is the security deposit you have charge 500 let's say activation that today is the activation set and uh, or when is the activation that so you just select that or uh, else you can just enter and you can just change the year so after all you just click on save then the customer will be added the customer is added so that is how to add the customer you want to view all the customers just click on view customer customer id you have to enter that is the one that i want to search so that is how you are going to search a customer this customer is not exist so you can just go on those thing now next one is all rented you want to see all the books whichever is rented you can just from go view menu and then you can click on that and then all the rented book will be displayed and uh, you are opening all this form and you want to close all the form at the same time so go to windows and close all everything will be closed now setting under setting we can change the picture of the form the picture is changing the next time you open this form 